sort my camera. Wow. All right, and where's the window control? So I'm gonna want to put that down. I'll put that AC to max AC over there. Uh, so that one will turn on. That one will turn on. All right, hang on. Yeah, I was asking if I'd be able to turn the key. <laughs> All right, so push the button down. Um, push the green button down, and then pull back to so, go. So on the plow. Back is up when you push. So yeah, so you got to wait for it to do a safety check. So right. It's, so once this it's is done with that. You don't have to hit the green button on the plow. You only don't. On the wing. Only the wing. Because if you hit the one on the this on the plow, that'll turn your sander on in the winter. Oh dear! <laughs> I don't want to do that. Okay, so it'll beep at you when it's all done. All right. There just are a lot of buttons and. Wait, are these for the flashers? For strobes, the tailgate. Yeah, I was just wanting to switch the strobe. retarder. Yeah, well, no, I do. I'm gonna do the strobes after we're done with the plow. So still beeping. So yeah, okay. Yeah. So now you can control the plow. Okay. Now easy. Now let's turn it to recording. So pull it towards me to pull the blade yep. up. Back brings it up. Okay. Real easy. Whoa! That is. I still can't get over how touchy that is. Super and, sensitive. Oh yeah. And then left. Whoa! <laughs> you can't feel that when the truck's moving. It comes around pretty quick. And right. Whoa! <laughs> That's all the way to the right. Uh, try to bring her back. I'm trying to get her centered. All right, center. Whoa! And then real easy on down. Whoa! Pull that up a little. There. That is just, it's amazing how, how sensitive this is. Yeah, it's super touchy. And now how do you do this? So that one you gotta hold the button in. Push. Pull back on it. Pull back. So. Oh, yeah, no kidding. Up. There you go. And then push it again. Push down. Send it down. That is so cool. Whoa! Just pull that up a little. Whoa! <laughs> That's amazing. All right. And then I was wondering, I was kind of wanting to get a video of it actually to start up with the truck off and then set the camera up, turn it back on when from out of the cab. Okay. All right.
still rolling. Just, where's, your, where's your camera? Is I got it, it on? I got it right here. Okay. Just turned it on. So what we'll do... See, what's that? Stuff. Oh. This is just a plastic interfeather. Oh, that's in like to, to protect... And then that way... Wow. So here are your uh, turbos. So that's your turbo charger right in there. That's the top one, and there's the bottom one. Wouldn't recommend touching it. <laughs> Only the exhaust side. The exhaust side's hot. The, the compression side's a little warm, but the exhaust side will melt your fingers. Yeah. This is just... Wow. I still remember when I was doing the pre-trip with another guy. Oh. <laughs> so I tripped. Wow. And you got all these belts and hoses and tanks to look after. Yep. What's this? A lot. That's your antifreeze tank. Oh, I'm not sure if you heard. I remember Matt and Robert were telling me they used to mess with each other. There's a little switch on these you can turn so the heater's deactivated in the cab. Oh, it's a valve. There's, There's a, a little valve switch. <laughs> That's still funny, but that actually seems kind of mean. Used to be on the firewall, yeah, little, mine, on the max door on the firewall, Ooh. with the heat, right along the heater hose. Yeah, uh, I don't think this one. I don't know if one. that one has it. The one oh, I yeah, there's a little valve you shut the and it can turn it off. It turns it off, keeps it cold. Did you see these? Oh yeah, is that your suspension? This isn't. This is an assisted airbag. Uh huh. Because of the wing. Right, because there's, so there's so much strain Pulling being. The side of the truck oh. over. A lot of times the right front spring fatigues uh, yeah. and sags down. So they put that on there to help with all the excess weight hanging out off the side. I just realized one thing. I actually realized I didn't put this down all the way. That's fine. You can put it down. Well, I was just going to do that real quick because I didn't realize I couldn't see a lot from where the camera was shooting. I just want to make sure. I'll be keeping my eye on you from them. Are you going under the hood? Is it even if I yeah. Do you want me to help you shut that? No, I can shut it. I just, you can't lift the plow up when the hood's open. Right, right. Because that'll tear the... Because with the way where the plow mech is sitting, it'll just... Yep. And, and a lot of guys actually do that. Here. <gasps> yeah. It, it yeah. a lot of money to fix these hoods. How much is it for the hood? Just the hood. Without, like, all the lights. Well, they can repair them. Um, but it's about three or four thousand bucks. To Holy! Repair. Fiberglass is hard work. This is fiberglass? Yep. Wow. So Didn't ready? Know. Yep. All right. That's amazing. All right, now how do you do these locks? How do you do the locks on these? How do you how do you do the hood locks? I'm just appreciate. I just cannot believe all the stuff you guys let me do when I'm here. It's just, Fine, it's just. So you, you lift it up. Uh huh. And then push back down. And it locks in. All right. So now you can get in and fire it up. I'm just gonna Make get. Make sure your plows are both all the way down. Yep. Oh, gotta remember. And then of course I gotta let it do all the measurements and stuff before I start it. Yeah. It's a, it's called the Force America system. It has to boot up and program it. Right, because that turns off every time you shut the plow off. Yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> That's kind of annoying. <laughs> and it's just another excuse to hear that engine. <laughs> I just love the sound of the engine when it cranks. That's an amazing sound. All right. Testing E stop. E stop. Very much. Do a pre-trip. 
<laughs> and we were gonna do it on the we were gonna do it on the attenuator because the one on this plow's broken. I was gonna do it on the attenuator, and then I was gonna do a couple videos on the attenuator. Did, did you hear me blowing the horn earlier? I did. Yeah, I was actually I, I jumped each time. Yeah, I realized I had to do it twice because the first time the camera wasn't recording. Oh. All right, so is it still testing?